number that can be written as a real number. For example, there is no real number multiplied by itself equals negative 25. So you have to make the, 20, the answer, the square root of 25, be an imaginary number of 5. I am doing imaginary and real numbers. Imaginary number is the square root of negative real numbers. A real number is a value represented on a number of n. And my, my example is the square root of negative 16. You can't get a real number because if you multiply negative 4 times negative 4, you'll get a positive 16. So that would be a real number. So it's a negative imaginary number because it, it don't equal the square root of negative 16. The imaginary number is the square root of a negative real number. It can be written as a real number if multiplied by the imaginary unit. Real numbers are all values represented on a number line. This is an example. This problem cannot be solved because no real number times itself will give you negative 8. And this can't be solved because there's a negative 2 in the problem. So um, this doesn't have an answer. And this is an example of real numbers. This problem can be solved because 4 times 4 will give you 16. So the answer to this problem is 4. Yeah, right? <laughs> Yay! Oh my gosh. Ooh.